Africa needs money to do research. To date, African governments have not been contributing enough to keep all the Africans here. However, what continues is the presence of large sums of money for research. But these are highly competitive sums of money. And for Africans to become competitive, they need improving on certain areas. The workshop has identified certain weaknesses and are focusing on these weaknesses to ensure that African students become better competitors, winning themselves grants to embark on the pathway to independent research. The biggest challenge, of course, in Africa is always trying to lead your own research. You don't have the necessary skills, really, necessary to make a good application. So it could be that, yes, it's because of biasness, maybe, because you're coming from Africa. But then again, it's because maybe the quality of what we write is not good. Think of one big challenge, that's uh, obtaining funding around your area of interest. I believe that this training in grants writing skills is very, very crucial and very topical for me at this time. For me to be able to do the research and see the outputs and outcomes that I desire, a lot of funding is necessary. My wish for African healthcare is um, number one for us to take, um, let us take possession of the knowledge. Um, let's not depend on, on knowledge gotten from other countries, other developed countries. I'd like to eventually become a research leader with a group of my own uh, pursuing the kind of questions which are, are interesting and important for me and the community. I'm someone who likes to find answers to questions. I see questions arise a lot of times and I'm not interested in research that is just only contributing or adding knowledge. No, I'm looking for research that has answers to problems to questions. If you get a better health system that that poor person in the village will not have to worry about having to accrue a lot of money to go get medication that they can actually just go to a point of care and get the medication. And if this happens, of course, the money that I have or that poor person has, they will focus on getting food and they're not worried about these health problems. We should take possession of our healthcare. We should be able to say, uh, this is what suits us. This is what we can do. This is the type of treatment that works for us. I think the people who know Africa's problems best are African practitioners and and researchers, I think the people who should be generating the research questions should be from, from Africa. We are supporting fantastic early career scientists, young scientists, to build their careers so that they can do the research that will make a difference for African patients and African people.